So my son James is also a plant scientist and he was conducting an experiment. When it was over, he forgot about the plants. And they spent a month in the greenhouse. Nobody took care of them, nobody watered them. And everything was dead, except one plant. In the coming years, the world and agriculture in particular are going to face some enormous challenges. What rainfall is becoming more variable, the aquifers are drying up, the world is running out of water, especially water for agriculture. Proso millet is the most water efficient grain we have on the planet. It will produce, for a given amount of grain, it uses half as much water as any other crop. What is proso millet used for? It looks a little bit like rice, a panicle, lots of small seeds. It's used for direct human consumption in many places in Asia, but it's a perfect drop-in substitute for corn in animal feed as well as ethanol production. So if we want to adapt corn for the future world with less water, we could make it more water efficient. Or we could take an existing water efficient crop and increase its yield. There are a lot of people working on the first thing. We decided to work on the second. How do you think it fits into the rotation in Iowa? Farmers in Iowa are hungry for a third crop. They need another crop to add to a rotation. Third crop would give us more diversity, greater stability, um, and it would be better for the soil. The exciting thing about proso millet, many, there are many exciting things. Some of them are it, it uses less water. It uses less nitrogen in Iowa. It is resilient. The, the even bigger thing is it contributes to sustainability of food supply. As you know, I've spent my whole professional career we're doing fundamental research on corn. But here was an opportunity to make a much more direct uh, contribution to food security and economic development in both Iowa and then food security around the world. <laughs>